So, week 12 now. And I thought I was done. But I now found out how much I just don't love my job. So, I worked. 51 plus hours the other week and then I put in like 42 hours this week because I was a little late or it would have been like 44 45 and who knows there's still two days left so I might get called in um, anyhow this has led me to be like eh, maybe I should dump that all into dividend stocks in particular so I took the like five, six ish hundred dollars because I don't know how much that is to you. I don't make that much at my job compared to a lot of people out there. Um, so I put that all into Coca Cola. I bought 10 more shares of Coca Cola and that brings my total to 65 shares out of my long-term plan of hitting about 69 shares giggity is my um real like kind of in goal ish area even though it'll probably end up being more than that but as of right now to like pay all my bills getting about 69 shares of coca-cola would be 10 percent of what i would want my portfolio to be and feel confident that the dividends alone could at least just barely get me squeaking by paying all my bills for a year. So now that my work's been just kind of beating me down a little bit, um, I'm gonna re-invest uh, in the stock market again. I had like a whole four or five year plan, but I'm gonna try and uh, cut a year off of that. Uh, my previous plan was basically increase my dividends by about $300 a year and then just each year try and make another $300 in dividends, make another $300 in dividends, which Coca-Cola increased by about 5.5% this year, their Carger rate or whatever you call it. Um, so that was pretty promising and I kind of looked at that versus uh, buying a treasury and it's uh, the interest rate the treasury is at right now, 20 year treasury, would maybe be better, maybe not. I don't know, it's hard. You have to kind of predict what you think Coca Cola, how much it's going to increase over time. Um, either one's a good idea, in my opinion. Uh, treasury's a little safer. I was kind of thinking putting like 4,100 in a treasury, 4,100 in Coke, but now I'm just kind of screw it. I think after 20 years, Coca-Cola is going to uh, be the better investment. I think also Coca-Cola in 20 years isn't going to be $60 a share anymore. I think it's going to be, you know, 75 80 maybe. Maybe even more. Who knows? Maybe they'll do a split. I don't know. Future. No one knows. So, yeah, main point. I'm going back to investing again. Because even though I should have my $700 this year, which was the goal, and it would be 1000 next year to make in dividends, uh, I'm going to see where I can take it. If I can get this to 850 this year, 900 maybe even 1000 that could potentially shave a whole year off of my essentially six-year plan, which I'm two years into. But yeah, um, gotta try and make that money, and I mean, I don't know, I can keep working my job, I, it ebbs and flows, kinda hate it sometimes, kinda not, other times, so, yeah, you just gotta keep doing what you're doing, and you've gotta keep investing, so yeah, thanks, um,